Going on, True Team. Hey, man, I, happy Thanksgiving to people, you know, all the real motherfuckers. You know, I don't really celebrate Thanksgiving, bro. I, I don't, you know, I'm cel I celebrate it with my mother, like my, my circle of family, my mother and my sister. You get what I'm saying? Thanksgiving fake, bro. All these holidays is fake, you know. Motherfuckers be moving on to the next year and still be the same motherfucker that they've been for 12, 13 years. They never changed who they was. You know, uh, I was watching Trans Genius the other day and he was saying some shit. Shout out to him, though, uh, big brother. Shout out to him, man. He was saying some shit um, yesterday about like how he went in the store and he seen motherfuckers and their energy was all off and shit about thanksgiving like motherfuckers just look like they weren't happy about thanksgiving he seen uncles with their nephews he seen mothers with their kids he seen daughters with their sisters he seen i mean he seen daughter he seen daughters with their mothers he seen um sisters with their brothers and shit like that grandmothers with grandkids and shit like that he seen all that and he said he just realized that the energy that i was being put out in that grocery store was that he seen that it wasn't no love or nothing like nobody everybody was faking it and I said, bro, yeah, Thanksgiving fake. Just like Christmas, all this shit be fake. Motherfuckers spend their Christmas and Thanksgivings and holidays with their inner circle family, with their mothers and fathers and sisters because, you know, a lot of this shit be fake, man. It don't feel the same as it used to back in the day, you know, where family was most valued and things was most, people that you love was most valued. You know why Thanksgiving and holidays don't feel the same? Because this social media app, man. You know, everybody feel like they, they don't appreciate what they have. Everybody feel like they can get more. They don't appreciate what they have. Everybody feel like they can get more, man. And, you know, especially, you know, especially these women nowadays, bro, like where they, a lot of women are not happy, but they, they worried about Thanksgiving and they've been up dealing with turkey ass niggas. They got niggas that beat on them. They got niggas that don't appreciate them. They ain't got nothing to be thankful for in their life because they all, they all fucked up mentally. A lot of people in this world be niggas and women be fucked up mentally, narcissistic mentally, disease, got a diseased mind mentally, think fucked up, moving fucked up, acting fucked up. And out of one year out of their life, they decide to be calm. Out of one year out of their life, they decide to have peace. Out of one year out of their life, they decide to, out of every holiday, the same holiday, every fucking year, they decide to have peace. They decide to be comfortable. They decide to move and move in the enlightenment of love. They decide to be real people on these, these particular days. And this is what I mean by I don't fuck really fuck with Thanksgiving because it's fake. Family don't value each other no more. Motherfuckers dying around here every day, every single motherfucking day, bro. And we literally sit here and act like shit not going on. Salute to the people who lost loved ones and, and, and they wish their family was here for Thanksgiving. Salute to the motherfuckers that's actually got a pure heart in this world and love and care for others and want to see motherfuckers grow and internally heal. Salute to the people out here, man, who got a fucking soul and move as they supposed to in this world. Salute to all the black men and black women out here who trying to be better people who want to grow. Keep away from all the black motherfuckers out here who ain't doing nothing with their life and, 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 and treating shit as if life don't motherfucking matter and doing shit as if life don't matter. Salute to all the people out there who got love, who cherish, who do the right things that they supposed to do for the ones they love. Salute to the people who all got a, a mind of a mind of godly thoughts and a mind of a mind of being love and showing love and moving in the alignment and love and making sure they and and the ones that's protected by God around here, man. Because one thing motherfuckers got to get, bro, we all going to leave this earth one day. Everybody. And for us to appreciate, it, it shouldn't take for us to lose motherfuckers for us to appreciate them. But I blame social media because it's like motherfuckers, like I said, motherfuckers feel like they can get away more than they actually have. And then when they finally, then when they lose the people that's in their life or something happens to them good people in their life, they sitting there crying and, and, and trying to redeem themselves from the fucked up thought that it happened. You get what I'm saying? And you you know, man, you know, man, we all we all got a date, an expiration date on us, my nigga. I just want people to understand every day that you move in these these holidays and every year you start to realize that you're not you're not changing and you're living in the same existence. You're moving as the same person. You're not going nowhere. You you began to understand that you're a revolving door to your own self and you began to understand that you're not healing or you're not growing because healing is a part of growing, man. And if you're not healing, you're not growing. If you don't forget what a motherfucker done to you, or you don't forget what the other person done, or you what you done to somebody else, you would never grow, man. Like one thing I learned, my nigga, I have been through a lot this year, bro. Every year has been enough for me. And you know, I, I seen Steve Harvey say something, man. He said, success is not 
about where you're heading to. It's about where you started from from where you at now. And that really stuck with me, you know, man. I'm thankful for every fucking moment that I ever get to wake up, breathe air, look at my mama, look at my mom and my sister. No matter how the relationships may be, I still try to keep them there because I know that we don't have this much time on this earth and we suffering from a mental mental health. Like a lot of us have mental health issues and that's why I tell black people in the community to seek therapy because we all suffer from shit like that. And I know a lot of, like I said, I know holidays is not the same no more, man, because people is out here losing their life every day. People's mind ain't even stuck in a holiday spirit. People ain't even feeling like it's, it is the holiday. People ain't even ready for Christmas because they ain't even got enough money to get their kids shit either. And, you know, salute to the strong parents out there. Salute to the real mothers, the mothers who actually care about their kids and ain't fucking selfish and do shit for their own selfish intent. Salute to the fathers that actually care about their family and the ones who try to bring, go down in the back, go, go, go to war for them as much as they can, you know. But Thanksgiving, man, ain't it ain't for everybody. You know, I, I don't look at like, like I say, I don't look at holidays the same. I just don't, man, because I feel like everybody is, it's a, it's a bunch of fake shit, a bunch of fake ass people and a bunch of lot, not no love, no sincereness, no, no, no integrity, no, 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 no understanding, no nothing. Like people live their everyday life just because of a lot of people just breathing on this earth for no motherfucking reason and not living out their purpose or not enjoying a life that way it's supposed to be. Understand, bro. I know y'all every. I know y'all be seeing how motherfuckers be making like New Year's, New Year's resolutions and shit, and they be like, "I'm gonna try to work on this, and I'm gonna try to work on that, and I'm gonna try to work on this." But it's like, them motherfuckers still be the same, and they never change. And you knew these motherfuckers for long. If we give our, if we give our hearts and our heads to God, bro, a lot of things in the world will be a different type of aspect. Family will be different. We'll look at these holidays as more. You get what I'm saying, like. I don't even celebrate 4th of July, to be honest with you. That shit, that shit a slave trait too. So people got to understand, man, we either walk on this valley of, of healing each other or we walk on the valley of unhealing each other and more chaos in the world. And it's all about how you, how you precipitate energy and what you do. Everybody is not meant to be talked to and everybody is not meant to be around and everybody is not meant to give your time to because... Regardless of the fact, you got way more vultures and Satan, women and men out here than you got godly children and chosen people. People who, people, one thing about, one thing, this, I'm going to end it off like this. Just because who you, just because you real to who you want to be real to, that don't make you real. To, for the mothers out here who got in, in relationships with their men and don't pride for those, and don't, and don't respect those relationships that they had. And for the men out here, just because. You chase you chasing other bitches and you doing different shit, man. Remember, not being thankful for what you have can lead to lifelong term of stress and, and 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 mental disorder. But you know, happy Thanksgiving to the ones that 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 truly got love for the people that they be around and truly have love for each other. The ones that's in their inner circle of family. Peace. Follow me at actual truth underscore. Follow me at tg.truth. Like, comment, subscribe to actual truth. Peace.